Fantastic. Um, this is Comet and Tierney, they're Harry and Hermione, obviously, if you, you'll know that if you're a Harry Potter fan. Uh, we've got young DJ as Sully, he's nine months old. Just how cute is he, look at that. <laughs> I think the light's a bit bright for him. Uh, we've got Daniel the Lizard, or Kurt Connors as he quickly corrected me. And he's even committed to come with a broken arm. That's, that's commitment to the cause, that, so give him a big round of applause. Now, I don't know whether you want to turn around and show her off. This is Natasha. Uh, we've affectionately started calling her Chutasha. She's four months old, and it's one of the cutest things I think I've ever seen, to be honest. So, yeah, we picked her out just for the cute factor, definitely. And we've got Obi-Wan Toby. I think he's supposed to be Obi-Wan Kenobi, but he's just not quite there pronouncing it, is he? He's, he's, he's cuter than anything. And that lightsaber must be dead tasty. So that is our six entrants, folks, and we want you to help us pick a winner. Myself and Jesse McClure from Storage Hunters are going to narrow it down to three, first of all, and then your loudest cheer will help pick the winner in this category, okay? We've got a couple of teddies, a trophy, and two cinema tickets to Cineworld, kindly donated by Cineworld, so thank you very much to them. If you guys want to do a little walk around in a circle on the stage for me, I'm just going to confer with uh, my fellow storage hunter. Just be a sec. Guys, if you want to line up for me again, please. Myself and Jesse have had a little uh, chat, and we've selected our three final places. Hermione, if you can step forward for me, please. Yeah, I know there's two. That could be a bit confusing. Uh, Sully, can you step forward for me, please? And Obi Wan Toby, can you step forward for me, please? There we go. As for everyone else, commiserations, thank you for entering. The costumes are fantastic. Well done to getting this far. Okay, if you guys want to make your way up the stage for me, give them a round of applause, everyone. Thank you. Right then, it's over to the floor now. This is where you guys come into your own. We want you to pick the winner. We're not going to do it. It's too difficult. We're going to let you kill the kids' dreams today. Okay? So... It's the loudest cheer. If you want Sully to win, give me a cheer. It's good. Herbology Hermione. Obi-Wan Toby. Oh, it's difficult. I think they were definitely the loudest, weren't they? So we're gonna go with them for now. Thank you very much for entering. Thank you for the applause, guys. Right then, the loudest one wins. Here we go. Herbology Hermione. <laughs> Obi Wan Toby. <laughs> I think Hermione's just taken it. <laughs> Congratulations, well done. We've got a little runner up prize. Oh, and I've just chucked it on the floor for Obi Wan Toby. There you go, my friend. 
Thank you very much for entering. It's been amazing. Well done. And Hermione, you've won two cinema tickets to Cine World, a Luigi Teddy and a trophy. I'll let you take them because my hands are full. Give it a big round of applause everybody, the under 16s here. Thank you Katie. Well done. Right then, it's the over 16s now. And we again, we selected these outside. So, I'm looking for Craig as the Flash. I'm looking for Ian as the Lizard. I'm looking for Anne as Professor Sprout from Harry Potter. We've got Craig as Seymour and he's brought Audrey along. Lema as Organa. And Mark as Jareth the Goblin King from Labyrinth. You okay there, Em? Yeah, there we go. Mind that speaker on your way up? I've done it a couple of times today. Now Flash, don't stand on his tail, okay? <laughs> Check these out for costumes. How incredible are they? I have to walk sideways through doors these days. <laughs> the metabolism just won't keep up anymore. Right then, so, Anna's Professor Sprout. Who made your costume for you? Is, is she here now? Give her a big round of applause. She made this costume, Ripley over there, well done. Have you had a good time today? Oh yes, fantastic. Are you going to come again? Oh, so Great stuff. And everybody. Next up we've got Craig as Seymour. He's brought Audrey along as well. It's absolutely brilliant. How long did this take you to make? The old name, actually. Every, everybody's making up costumes. Did you make this as well? Do you know what? Come up here. And Get yourself mandrake. up here. She made the mandrake too. And, and, and the she made Hermione's mandrake as well from the film. We've got to get her some recognition for this. This is the lady who's made these fantastic costumes up here. Give her a big round of applause. I'm just, I'm just going to include her in the vote because I think she deserves to be in there. So well done. Then we have Ian as the lizard. I just about got his name through this little uh, mouth hole here. Have you had a great time today, Ian? Absolutely first class. You can't beat Stoke. You can't beat Stoke. I agree. Uh, best cosplay of the year last year, last year, by the way. So thanks to everybody who voted. We're getting better and better every every event. Thank you for entering. Then we've got Craig as the Flash. Hi. <laughs> yeah, it's been really, really good event. It seems to get better every year. Now some of these you made yourself and some bits you didn't, but you've done all the modifications, haven't you? How long did it take you? Um, the longest part was the boots, because they just came with shoe covers, so I had to modify the soles to get an actual boots I could have to attempt to run, <laughs> trying to uh, keep the character. That's what took the longest time, the rest seemed simply nothing to say, getting the stitching and everything done. It turned out really well, great effort, well done. And then we've got a legend in the house today. <laughs> And I've seen some great photos of your face in the ball and everything. It's, it's fantastic. Um, we've got Mark here as Jareth the Goblin King from Labyrinth. It's a great costume. Have you enjoyed yourself today? It's been fantastic. How good does it feel to get to this stage? I can't believe it. On all these amazing co cosplay outfits and I'm up here. I can't believe it. It's been really difficult to pick, let me tell you. And then we have Lema. Am I pronouncing that correctly? Close enough, <laughs> as Ogana from League of Legends, and again, another amazing costume. The standard has been absolutely amazing this year. Have you had a great time today? Yeah. Are you confident? To what, in? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, the fists up. She's fist pumping. Great stuff. Right then, if you guys want to have a quick walk around the stage, if you want to come this way, and we'll go around anti-clockwise, okay? So, Ogana, if you follow me. <laughs> And I'm going to confer with Jesse again about who we think should be put through to the final three. <laughs> His tail's stopping everybody from moving. 
Just do your best for us. Thank you. Right then, guys, if you want to get yourself back into a line for me, I've just conferred with Jesse. That's commitment dragging that round with you all day. Well done. <laughs> Right then, we've narrowed it down to Craig as Seymour with Audrey, but we're going to put Ripley through as joint entrant because she made it. So if you guys just want to step over here for me, please, thank you. And then we've picked Lima as Organa. If you want to step forward for me, please. And we've gone with the lizard. For pure effort alone. Step forward for me, please. Everyone else, thank you very much for entering. You've done brilliantly to get to this stage. Great costumes. If you could make way up the stage for me, thank you very much for entering. I've just been corrected, it's more gone. There we go. The princess is your favourite. Right then, are we ready? Again, it's over to the floor. This is up to you now, guys. You get to choose the winner. I'm going for the loudest cheer. We'll eliminate one first and then we'll get it down to two. So, Morgana. <laughs> The lizards, <laughs> complete with funky dancing, and Seymour and Audrey. <laughs> it's good. I think these two are loudest, Morgana. I'm afraid. So thank you for getting to this stage. Give her a big round of applause, everyone. Very well done. And again, it's over to you guys. This is the important part now. This is the winner for the over 16s category. Are we going with the lizard? <laughs> Seymour and Audrey. <laughs> the lizard. <laughs> Seymour and Audrey. <laughs> I think the dynamic duo have just about taken it. Give them a big round of applause, everybody. Ian, commiserations mate, fantastic costume, thank you for entering. Thank you very much. Give them a big round of applause everyone. So we got you up as a double act. I couldn't let, I could not let you up here without giving you the credit you deserve. You're really good at this. How long did it take you to make that? Oh, um, but she's been a working project for a couple of years now. So we've done exhibitions with her, so she's grown and no, she's open her mouth. There's a hand in there. Wow. Uh, that's her last meal. <laughs> well, whatever the case, you make a great team. Thank you very much. You won yourself two Sydney World vouchers and a bottle of champagne. Very well done. Give me a round of applause, everyone.
Right then, stick around because coming up in five minutes we've got an auction, so don't miss that one. Some great stuff to auction off today. Have your pennies ready. For more videos, please visit www.northstaffstv.com.